Hello guys, this video will show you how you can bridge objects in a CAD program in this example plasticity. And real quick guys, if you're interested in learning plasticity, I've got a new course on Udemy. Link is in the description, it's the first one there. I've got tree cutting mechs, I've got SMGs, I've got dark energy swords, I've got spider drones, and much more content on the way. There's about 30 hours of content right now and more is being added weekly. All right, so when you're working with a polygon program, it's as simple as just selecting two faces and then, you know, clicking on bridge, and there you go. But when working with CAD, there's a lot of power, but some things are just done a little bit differently. So let me show you how to do in plasticity. So what I would do here is I would press three to switch the face level, selection mode. I would select this, and then I'll hold shift and select that. So let's say these are the two faces I want to bridge. And by the way, guys, if you know an easier way to do this, please let me know, but here's what I've got here. Press Control 2 to switch to, to convert the faces into the border edges right here, and then press Shift D to clone them. All right, I'll isolate that, now I've got this. I will select and press L for Loft. You can delete those original edges right there. All right, so now we have holes here. So I'm gonna press four to go into the body selection when I'll select this. I'm going to click on patch holes. I'm going to get rid of these holes right here. As you can see, we've got that now. I exit isolation mode. And because we perfectly created that out of those edges, we can now simply select all that and press. So as you can see right now, they are separate bodies here. We can now select that and press QQ to bring them together. And now, as you can see, they are now one object and we can continue to work with this. All right, let me give you another example to some more complex. Let's say I want to bridge this face with that face. So once again, I'll press Control 2 to convert to the border edges here. Shift D, L to loft, select this, patch the holes. Now I'll select these and QQ. As you notice, it didn't work because it's not able to patch holes when you have a complex thing happening like this. So here's what we need to do. We need to actually uh, clone out those faces. So I'll select this and this and then Shift D. So right now these are still separate objects. What I'll do is I'll select them all. I'll press F for the search command. J-O-I-N, join sheets. And now it is a single object here, which means that now we can select, you know, they're still separate right here. We can select all this and then QQ. And we have now bridged that. And we can now continue to uh, do that and work with that. All right, thank you for watching and take care.